everyone. I think there's a fire, uh, there's a fire burning on the horizon. Because I got Anna And who's the spark? I think it's you. <laughs> yeah, very excited about that. How you been? I've been great. Yeah? Yes. How are you enjoying London? I love it. Yeah. We went on a little little shopping spree and we had some oh. great... Oh, yeah, it's right. Yeah, it's we had going. some great lunch yeah. and um, we love it. Yeah? Yeah. So, um, first of all, I was trying to ask, um, with the Manifest Return, um, how did you feel about it? Because, obviously, last time, we're not going to talk about what happened there. No, 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 no. Yeah, we'll just skip that part, because <laughs> we're nice. Um, was there a lot of pressure to come back? Because, obviously, like, a lot of your... F- I don't know if you... Well, my friends interviewed you the other time in Sweden and showed you Twitter stats. Yes. So... When you saw those co- when you saw those comments from everyone, did it kind of make you feel like a little bit more excited coming back, or was it was it that type of reaction? That you had? Yeah, well, of course it made me more excited, and I was kind of I was very surprised because I didn't know I had the kind of fan fan base in the Eurovision yeah. scene. Um, I mean, I have some some followers on on Facebook and Instagram, but I didn't yeah. know that that they were like hardcore fans like that. So I was very very happy and yeah. excited about that. Yeah, you've yeah. got a lot of fans who really love your debut album as well. So, Great. so you, so you, you'll see them tonight, and you know that they'll be singing along to both of those songs. Amazing. Yeah. Yeah. So, what will you be performing for us tonight? Will you be performing? I'll be doing both. This yeah. is my life, and Ashes to Ashes. Yeah. Um, how does it feel performing it again? Is it kind of like melancholic, or are you still happy performing? This is my life. I love that song. Um, it's kind of high in, in pitch, and yeah. it's been 10 years, and I think my vocal cords have changed. Yeah. So it's kind of high for me now, uh, but I'll manage. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and with Ashes to Ashes, like, because I think when you went to Andra Hansen, mm-hmm. when everyone was like, when you were performing, every, it was your hometown, wasn't it? So that's the reason why they were so excited. Because literally, <laughs> I think you were being drowned out by, like, yeah. the cheering on when... Yeah. And I think like a lot of people like circumvene their way around the app to like ah! <laughs> give you the hearts. You know a lot of UK fans support you, so it's would amazing. you ever consider coming here to promote your music more? Well, obviously you've done it today. Well, I would love to. Mm-hmm. Um, I, I get so surprised that there are so many fans here and I realize that maybe I could do a show, so I would yeah. love to. Yeah. All right then, so since 2010, You've been training to be a doctor? Yes. Yeah. And how's that going for you? It's going well, but now there's so much with my with my music, so I had to take a break. Yeah. Uh, uh, med school is more than 100%, so yeah. you know, you have to be focused every day. Yeah. So I couldn't do that right now. So I've I've taken a break, but I'll be yeah. coming back. I will be a doctor. Yeah, so if any of you are in Sweden and you know, feeling unwell, <laughs> This is the girl. Yeah, that is the girl. <laughs> and Laffy, just to wrap things off, um, have you got a message to all of our fans who are watching you right now? Thank you so much for your support. I hope to be seeing some of you tonight at Café de Paris in London. Otherwise, I hope to see you somewhere else in Europe. I love you. Great, and talk to me, Kana. Talk to me, yeah. <laughs>